your latest news update from Western Mass News. Good Tuesday afternoon. I'm Chris Pisano with a look at your headlines. A lawsuit filed by Holyoke Soldiers Home employees has been dismissed by a judge. The employees claim the people in charge of the home put workers in danger during the pandemic and caused irreparable harm. However, the judge ruled that the people being sued didn't cause the danger since they didn't create the COVID-19 virus. Election Day is just over a month away and the race is on for the next governor and lieutenant governor of Massachusetts. Republican candidate for governor Jeff Deal says one of the biggest issues he would hope to address if he were to become the next governor of Massachusetts is making sure parents have more of a say on the curriculum taught at their children's schools. And a Southwick man is facing manslaughter charges in connection to a deadly 2021 crash over the state border in Connecticut. Police say 25-year-old Dominic Grissetti turned himself into state police yesterday under the authority of an arrest warrant. He was held on $150,000 bond and presented before a judge in Enfield Superior Court. Well, the remnant low of Ian continues to pinwheel some showers across Western Mass, and we'll be dealing with more of those showers tonight. Breezes out of the north could be a little bit gusty at times, especially early on, but we should keep a bit of a breeze during the overnight hours with temperatures falling into the mid-40s. We keep cloudy skies as we go into Wednesday. Scattered showers will continue, especially through the first part of the day. Showers expected to taper off by the late afternoon and evening. It'll be another raw day with highs in the middle to upper 50s and a healthy breeze coming down out of the north-northwest. Now, as we continue Continue through the rest of this week, we have some big improvement coming in our weather. High pressure digs south, and that's going to bring back sunshine for Thursday and much warmer temperatures. Even Friday looking mild, but an approaching cold front is going to bring an increasing breeze and the chance for an isolated shower or thunderstorm toward the end of the day. Behind that system, it turns breezy and much cooler. Highs look to be in the low to mid 70s for Thursday and Friday, and then Saturday we're back to mostly sunny skies, mid 50s, and gusty breezes. Stay with Western Mass News on air, online, and on our app throughout the day for breaking news, weather, and exclusive content.